Jacob deceives or tricks Isaac. Abraham and Sarah had a son called Isaac. Isaac married Rebecca and they had twins, two sons, called Jacob and Esau. Esau was born first, he was the oldest. Jacob was born a few minutes later. Esau was a tough, wild hunter, and his father Isaac admired him. Jacob liked to stay at home. He was very close to his mother, Rebecca. As time went on, Isaac got older. His eyes didn't work so well. He became blind. One day, he called for his oldest son, Esau, the hairy hunter. Esau, Isaac said, I'm getting old. My eyes do not work well, and soon I will die. I want you to take your bow and arrow and to go out and to hunt an animal. Kill it, bring it back, and cook it for me, a tasty food. Prepare my special dish that I love to eat, and then I will bless you. I will bless you before I die. So Esau went off on a very long hunting trip to find an animal to cook. Meanwhile, Rebecca was listening to what Isaac had said to her son Esau. She went straight to Jacob with a deceitful and tricky idea. Listen, Jacob, she said to her son, I have a plan that will get you your father's blessing instead of Esau, your oldest son. She told Jacob to get two goats from their flock in the field. She said, I will prepare a very tasty meal with the goats, and then you take it to your father, who is blind, and pretend to be Esau. And then he will bless you instead of your older brother. But Jacob was worried. Esau has scary skin, Jacob said. If my father touches me, he will know that I'm lying and he will curse me for tricking him in this terrible way. Rebecca thought, hmm, I know. She took some goat skin and she wrapped the goat skin around Jacob's hands and arms and around his neck. Now Jacob felt hairy just like his brother the wild hunter. So Jacob went to Isaac with the tasty food and with some tasty bread and he lied. <clears throat> I'm Esau, Jacob said. I've been hunting and I've cooked you your favourite food. Rise up and eat, father, and then bless me. How did you find and kill the animal so quickly? Isaac asked. Uh, <clears throat> the Lord blessed me, Jacob replied. Come near to me, Isaac asked suspiciously, and he reached out and he touched the goatskin that was wrapped around Jacob. You do feel hairy like my son Esau. Isaac asked, Are you really my son Esau? Yes. Jacob lied. And so Isaac blessed Jacob. He said, may nations serve you, my son. May all the peoples bow down to you. May you be master over your brothers and head of this family. May everyone who curses you be cursed by God. And may everyone who blesses you be blessed by God. Just after Jacob had left his father's tent, Esau came home from hunting. He prepared a meal, his father's favourite food, 
and then he went into the tent. Rise up and eat, father, Esau said, and then you can bless me, your oldest son. <gasps> Who are you? Isaac asked. I'm Esau, your firstborn, your oldest son. Isaac began to tremble. Then who was here before? Somebody tricked me and brought in food for me and I blessed him. And now I can't take back my blessing. It was your brother, Jacob. Esau let out a loud, bitter cry. Bless me too, father, Esau cried. Your brother has tricked you. He has taken your blessing. I have made him master over you. All his brothers will be his servants. There is no blessing left for you, Esau. Esau cried and cried. Jacob, uh, Isaac said, you will live far away from the best land that we own. Your brother will be your master. After that, Esau hated Jacob. When my dad has died from old age, I will kill my brother, Esau said. Rebekah heard about Esau's plan to kill his brother, so she sent Jacob away to live with her brother Laban in Haran. She said, when your brother Esau has calmed down, then I'll send a servant to bring you back. <laughs>